It's funny how Samsung never really stops. Just when everyone's getting comfortable with One UI 8.0, the company's quietly preparing a follow-up that might shake things up again and sooner than you'd think. Leaks are hinting that One UI 8.5 could begin testing before the year even ends, and if that happens, Galaxy users might be in for an early taste of the future around late November 2025. The craziest part. Samsung might finally expand its beta rollout strategy, and that's got everyone talking. Hey everyone, welcome back, Sam here. If you love keeping up with Samsung's latest moves, don't forget to like the video, share it with your tech buddies, and subscribe so you never miss the next drop. Alright, let's dive in. Now here's the wild part. Samsung's not just pushing out a minor patch. One UI 8.5 is shaping up to be a mid-cycle update that actually feels like a major one. The company wants smoother visuals, smarter AI integration, and a design language that feels even more natural to use. We're talking refined animations, faster system response, and a UI that finally looks as fluid as it performs. It's that sense of polish Samsung's been chasing for years. And this time, they might have nailed it based on insider leaks. The beta program could kick off in Samsung's usual test regions, South Korea, the US, Germany, and India, and if things go well, it could later expand to more countries. Eligible devices? Expect the Galaxy S25 series, including the S to 5S to 5 Plus, S25 Ultra, and maybe even the new S to 5 Edge, to get first access. Then, as usual, the S24 series will follow, along with the Z Fold 6, Z Flip 6, and possibly their upcoming 7th gen foldables. In other words, if you've got one of Samsung's latest flagships, keep those eyes on the software update section. You might get the beta notification before you know it, but the real excitement comes from what's inside One UI. 8.5 Samsung's clearly focused on refining the little things that make daily use feel more personal. The notification panel's now completely customizable. Drag, drop, and rearrange toggles until your layout looks exactly the way you want. The volume and brightness controls have gone vertical for easier access, while a redesigned music player flows seamlessly with album art transitions that look straight out of an iPhone level polish. But with that signature Samsung flair, the camera and gallery are getting big time attention too. The new floating menus with soft blur effects look elegant, and the camera app adds a clean viewfinder option for creators who hate distractions. Add built-in cinematic LUTs for instant color grading, and you've got a setup that makes smartphone filmmaking actually exciting again. Samsung's pushing hard for creators, and One UI 8.5 could turn every Galaxy phone into a pocket studio. Another thing fans will love, AI isn't just a background helper anymore. It's front and center. Samsung's improved its on-device AI engine, so tasks like transcription, call summaries, and smart replies run faster without draining battery. There's even talk of automatic call screening and voice summarization. Think of it as having your own mini assistant that actually learns your habits. Combine that with Gemini-powered routines and smarter Bixby triggers, and your phone starts feeling genuinely intuitive. Visuals are smoother across the board, too. The adaptive wallpaper system now perfectly resizes your lock screen photos, no more awkward cropping. Subtle gradient fades and transparency effects give every corner of the UI a sense of depth. Even Samsung DeX has been refreshed, making multitasking on a monitor look and feel cleaner than ever. And let's not forget about those everyday details. The new battery indicators are more precise, with text only or pill style options and the estimated battery time is now front and center. The weather widget shows live pollen levels finally a relief for allergy sufferers, and the settings app has been decluttered, making navigation feel effortless. Tiny things. Sure, but it's those tiny things that make One UI 8.5 feel alive. What's interesting is that Samsung hasn't officially confirmed any of this, but when multiple reliable insiders start talking, there's usually truth hiding in the leaks. If the timeline holds, we're looking at a beta rollout by the last week of November, with the stable release landing in early 2026, perfectly timed to launch alongside the Galaxy S to 6 series. 
So yeah, it's about to get busy dot and honestly, this feels like Samsung's smartest move yet. Instead of saving everything for One UI 9, they're refining the base early, turning 8.5 into the perfect bridge between where Galaxy devices are now and where Samsung wants them to be next year. A smoother interface, smarter AI, better visuals, and more personalization. That's the trifecta of updates users have been asking for Dotso. If you're using a Galaxy flagship, keep your software updater ready because once one UI 8.5 hits, it's going to change how your phone looks, feels, and even thinks. And the best part, you might be among the first to test it. That's all for today's deep dive into Samsung's next big update. If you enjoyed this one, don't forget, hit that like button, share this with your fellow Galaxy fans, and subscribe so you never miss the next leak, reveal, or surprise from the world of Samsung. Until next time, this is Sam signing off. Stay curious, stay connected, and I'll catch you in the next one.